Welcome back to the show. So the home team recently very excited to welcome a new weekend anchor and reporter recently. As it turns out, she's actually a hometown girl. Madison Wade hails from West Seattle. So this is a homecoming of sorts. It is. I am so happy to be here. I am so excited to have you. I, all, I just have to let you know, Madison basically created her career around coming back home. I did. King 5 has always been the goal. Oh, I here. love that. Yeah. We are so glad to have you here. We are truly honored. Um, and let's get to know you a little bit. First of all, yes. you puppies. Let's talk about your puppies. <laughs> They're amazing. I have two of them. One is a doodle and one is a, a rescue. They're both rescues, but their names are very Seattle. Okay. So the doodle is Griffey. <laughs> After obviously the Ken Griffey Jr. Yes. And then we have Filson on your left. Oh, he is obviously named after Filson, you know, so the clothing company. The outdoors wear company. So people probably Seattle. didn't even know about Filson outside of no, Seattle. His name finally makes sense here. Yes, it's I don't amazing. have to explain it. <laughs> Born and raised here, what made you want to come home? Everything about Seattle. I mean, I grew up here. My family's mm -hmm. still here. Yeah. And then King Five is just an incredible community of journalists and people that I have looked up to for so many years. Oh. And it really is full circle. I mean, anchoring next to Greg Copeland and Joyce Taylor, it, and it just kind of gives me that like pinch me moment. Like, yeah. am I really doing this right now? <sighs> Did I really come home and, and achieve this dream? So. It is true. It's happened. I'm very happy to be back. I, we have some from some footage in yes. breaking news. Some archival footage. Some archival here. footage here of Madison <laughs> Wade. What is this? Where are you? So I was a kid, obviously you can tell. <laughs> I'm pretty young there, trying to tell you what the weather was like in Mount Vernon. Um, the, this is the King Five Weather Center way back in the day at on the, the Dexter old, Avenue. Yes, at oh, the old building. Man. This is my first visit, but I also went again um, when I was in high school, and I met Joyce Taylor. Then I was told wow. to write. Uh, a paper about a profession I think I could do and I just decided you know what I'm gonna do journalism and King Five specifically so this has always been my goal my family's known about this since I was like 13 or 14. <laughs> I love it let's yeah. talk about your family they yeah, must be thrilled they are they're so excited to be for having me back home my dad actually decided to uh, come by my first live shot that's what this picture stop is when from. you are finished I, I yeah so he um, came by he asked me where was I going live and I was right outside of climate pledge arena <laughs> and he <laughs> came and grabbed us coffees and he fangirled for a moment and watched oh my, my live goodness. shot. I love him. I know. I it love was your really dad. Sweet. So and then there's my mom on the right, my stepdad in the middle. Um, they are both uh, hairstylists. They own their own salon in East Lake. Oh, nice. Yeah, and so I live two blocks away from my mom because and I wanted to be that close to get them. Get free hairstyling. Exactly. Lucky girl. It's amazing. And that's my sister, Jackie. Aww. She is my rock, my best friend. Oh my I have gosh. seen her every day since I've been home. You're giving me the chills yeah. with this family <laughs> happiness. I love it. It's amazing. I'm so happy to be back. I literally, yeah. you are so welcome here. I'm going to breath of fresh air. Thank you. I have to do tell you now it's time for well first before we get into the lightning run I do want right. to ask you about something that you've been very upfront about sobriety yeah absolutely so I'm really big into mental health mm -hmm. and uh, just through the pandemic I decided you know what this isn't serving me anymore mm -hmm. I was really relying on it for a crutch and yeah. a lot of people I think could probably agree yep. it was a very stressful time and I think we all just had um, you know that moment of what what can I do that's gonna make my mental health better and for me alcohol just was not serving me anymore yes I was rewarding myself with it and I didn't need to be doing that I should have rewarded myself with something more healthy a better choice and I decided to to stop drinking uh, a year and a month ago now. Congratulations. So, thank you. And I feel so much better. It's Do amazing. You? Yeah, Happier. I don't miss it at all. I've actually been having so much fun trying mocktails yeah. and going to restaurants and trying their alter alternatives. Um, so I don't I don't miss it. I'm glad to hear you say that. Yeah. And I'm glad that you have tied it to that mental health piece. It's so right. important. All right, now it's time for the lightning round. Okay. Are you ready? Okay. <laughs> Zodiac sign. Oh, and Taurus. Mm, okay. Yep. Favorite comfort food? Ooh. Ice cream. Okay. Yeah. Wildest story you've ever covered? Oh, that's a good one. So a woman who drove a Scooby-Doo van <laughs> led police on a high-speed <laughs> chase. Was this in Sacramento? Uh, this is in Reading, my first Redding, market. Redding, yes. 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 My first market ever. She drove a Scooby-Doo van. She led a police on a high-speed chase, and she got away. <laughs> yeah. So. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Celebrity crush? Oh, Bradley Cooper. Okay. Yeah. Favorite musical group or singer? Oh, my gosh. That's a great question. I would say ABBA. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. I love this girl. <laughs> and then finally, pineapple on pizza, yay or nay? It's a yay. It's a yay. All pizza's a yay. I love 
you. <laughs> you are fantastic. Thank we you. wish you the best of luck starting. Thank you. you can you you start anchoring every Saturday at what time? Four o'clock? Yes, yeah, so I'm on at five, mm -hmm, uh, five. for a full hour, six thirty, ten and eleven on the weekends. Well, I used to be the weekend anchor too. Yes. I understand what it's like. Madison, it's a Thank pleasure you. I'm so happy to, to meet here. you. You're gonna come back soon, right? Yes. Okay.